Netflix has been consuming our lives for a long time now, but we spend a little extra time with it thanks to the quarantine. Well, there are definitely some good TV shows you could binge for days. Today, we're going to take a look at some films, specifically action films. Before we get started, now please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and thank you for watching. 10. Polar Coming in at number 10 is Polar, an American-German action film from 2019 which stars like Mads Mikkelsen and Vanessa Hudsons. The film follows Duncan Vizsla, also known as the Black Kaiser, a top-tier assassin working for a company named Damocles. Duncan will be reaching his mandatory retirement in just two weeks, which is his 50th birthday. Conflict arises when he revealed that the owner of Damocles is having fellow assassins kill those nearing retirement and to keep their pension funds in possession of the company and inflating its value. While critics have said this movie is a tad bit violent and may not be for everyone, most fans that have felt compelled to give this film a try were satisfied with it as a whole. 9. Point Blank Coming in ninth place is the Netflix original 2019 action thriller Point Blank. This action-packed thriller stars Anthony Mackie and Frank Grillo, who are an ER nurse and career criminal respectively. This unlikely duo comes together to save Paul's Anthony Mackie's pregnant wife from kidnappers. While critics weren't very pleased with this film, it received some pretty average reviews from fans. If you like a good thriller with some twists and turns and don't mind a plot that's just a tad bit cheesy, uh, you should definitely give this film a try. 8. Triple Frontier Coming in 8th place is another Netflix original, Triple Frontier. This film follows Ben Affleck. Oscar Isaac, Charlie Hunnam, Garrett Hudlin, and Pedro Pasco as former Special Forces operatives that have decided to use their skills for themselves instead of their country. The group of soldiers decide to try and rob one of the world's most violent cartels, but things quickly spiral out of control. Critics and fans alike thought the general plot was a bit overused, and while that may be the case, you can still throw this film on for some mindless, chaotic action. 7. Den of Thieves Coming in at number 7 is the action thriller Den of Thieves, featuring some big names like Gerard Butler and 50 Cent. The movie focuses on the struggle between a group of relentless thieves and an equally relentless group of cops hell-bent on putting an end to their game. When the thieves get a little bored of simple bank heist, they decide to try and rob the Federal Reserve, a job no one has ever pulled off previously. While it still didn't have perfect ratings by any means, this film was generally well received by critics and fans alike. 6. Snowpiercer Snowpiercer, the science fiction action thriller, comes in at number 6 on the list. This film is a bit of a social commentary on Class 9867ism, but makes its point in an interesting way. We follow stars like Chris Evans and Tilden Swinton, on their journey in a post-apocalyptic world where all that's left of humanity is a small group of people stuck on an eternally moving train. The people in front of the train have a bit of a superiority complex that leads to people in the back being treated poorly until an inevitable uprising occurs. This film got also mixed reviews. Though critics and fans alike seem to generally appreciate the message it was trying to convey and how it accomplished this task. 5. Close Number 5 on your list is the film Close. When a wealthy heiress named Zoe, Sophie Nalis, is put in danger, she's assigned a lone security expert, Numi Rapaz, to keep her safe. After being kidnapped, the two break free and are forced to go on the run, an adventure with plenty of gunshots and explosions. While critics gave it a pretty mediocre rating, fans definitely still appreciate it and you should at least give it a chance, especially considering this is an action movie with female leads, an occurrence we don't see in the film industry as much as we should. 4. Angel Has Fallen Coming in at number 4 is Angel Has Fallen, the third film in the Has Fallen series. This film follows Gerard Butler as Michael Banning, a Secret Service agent who tries to protect the president, Morgan Freeman, from an assassination attempt but it's then wrongly charged with the attempted murder 
This typical murder mystery, good guy getting frame format, is pretty overused, but still be entertaining every once in a while. Critics thought this film relied a bit too much on mindless action and big name actors, but fans seemed generally pleased with the film. 3. Spencer Confidential Kicking off our top three is Spencer Confidential, an action comedy film featuring Mark Wahlberg, Post Malone, Eliza Schlesinger. Spencer, played by Mark Wahlberg, investigates the murder of Gloria Wisniewski. While doing this, Spencer and his partner Driscoll, played by Bokeem Woodbine, visits the house of Captain John Boylan. After seeing the abuse of Boylan towards his wife, Spencer engages in a brawl with Boylan, getting himself sent to prison for five years. 2. Six Underground Coming in at number 2 is Six Underground. This $150 million film features a cast of Ryan Reynolds, Melania Laurent, and Dave Franco. In this movie, Reynolds plays a character named One. One puts together a team of six to eliminate the likes of terrorists and other hardcore criminals. All of the individuals play a central role in the integrity of the team's goal to end harsh government regimes. Critics reviewed the movie poorly, mostly concerning Michael Bay's directing of it, saying things such as Michael Bay's Netflix debut is a little more than endless explosions and unbelievable plot and explicit content. Yet another critic mocks Michael Bay by saying Michael Bay creates a new brand with rhythm to it. Crash, boom, bullet through head, followed by a one-liner, a profanity, then walks off into the sunset, ready for sequels one through five. Fans related a similar viewing of the film. One, Extraction. Finishing off our list in the number one spot is Extraction. This action thriller is an hour and 57 minutes worth of Chris Hemsworth mercenary character, Tyler Rake, attempting to spare the life of a crime lord's son from his kidnappers. Other stars featured in this film are Gashita Ferharani and Randeep Huda. The story developers of Extraction are the famed Russo brothers, the same people that directed Marvel's Avengers movie series. The film has a critic review of 68% on Rotten Tomatoes. However, the audience review on Rotten Tomatoes is 69%. Richard Roper with the Chicago Sun-Times said, it's a shame this real crowd pleaser won't be playing to crowds, but it still works as a Friday night pop the popcorn living room entertainment. Well, we're off to go order some food and binge the movies on the list now. Are there any other action-packed films on Netflix right now that we should check out? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to leave and like a subscribe. And thank you for watching.